So what's up guys, it's God, I'm back. And uh, another hot video for y'all. Drop it like it's hot. And uh, got some questions, as usual. Always asking questions, never really uh, thinking I know the answers. Pretty odd for God, wouldn't you think? That's, uh, that's the first question, is how does that happen like that? And then um, the other questions are, um, you know, is it just me that has people uh, coming around me, talking to me about my personal life all over the place? Wherever I go, wherever I, they're there. Isn't this illegal? I mean, you know, I'm, I guess I'm God, right? And I should be forgiving because, hell, laws. Laws definitely aren't for gods. God decides what to do when he wants to do it. And then, um, when that stuff happens, uh, is that happening because I'm God and I'm inventing it? Or is that happening because I'm a politician trying to run for world leader? And, you know, President of the United States, as they call it. And I attracted the wrong intention. That doesn't fully add up to me because of understanding that I just didn't leave my house and go around people for a long time. Or still don't. Uh, like... I come outside just to make a video for you guys. Ah, I'm deceiving you, aren't I? <laughs> he says he doesn't go outside. He's outside. Literally just stepped outside to make the video. And already, I'm like making sure I'm like 20 feet of my door and got the keys in hand right now. But, um, yeah. Look, they say when I find money on the ground, I'm going to find a whole bunch more money. Ooh. I'm God. I don't remember inventing that theory that if I find money, I get more money. They told me that. It's like, uh, I, you know, that's kind of uncomfortable. When I uh, go places and people talk about what's in my mind and talk to me about my personal life, it's, to use the word kind of would, would imply I'm illiterate. You know, I'm not very good with English because the word kind of means kind of. And more accurately, I think the word would be entirely or something super far beyond the skin. You know, kind of over here. Maybe, kind of, yes, certainly. And then I'm like, I took one of Elon Musk's uh, Santa sleighs and flew out that direction beyond Probably, certainly, and if you breathe oxygen, you can be alive, and if you don't, you can die, you know, type certainty. And uh, so, so where am I wrong here? I'm not being stalked and terrorized. I'm literally inventing people with my brain and thoughts and... I mean, some of it's not me. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. Like, if I literally, like, sometimes it's like I, I'd be like, oh, the leaf's dying. And then someone dies near me. Something like that. Like, I mean, like, there's some stuff that happens here. I don't necessarily, I don't think, I don't remember calling for war every time war happened when someone uh, stepped on my toes. Although... I definitely do in the open these days. Who knows? I don't remember everything. That's a good thing, though. Right? Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> it's weird how I remember certain things that all add up to trying to understand this. And I don't remember anything else of value like kissing someone or holding someone. And, you know, those little mundane things people do. Shopping in a store or whatever. So, like, uh, am I really supposed to believe that the reason why I can't run for president in ruler of the world is I'm God? But didn't these people write a book saying I am ruler of the world and I'm going to be ruler of the world if I'm God? I did. 
What? What happened here? Um, like, uh, did I like uh, try to cut the storyline short and like before it, like stop the wars before they happen and stuff? And that's just not able to happen in the game. The game doesn't understand that. I I begin to understand what's happening real fast. And so I'm like, okay, I know how to cut this off. Like, we'll just run for president. We'll just throw everything away. We, we ain't got the time. We ain't got the... We ain't, well, we got the time. We can make it. We ain't got the money. We ain't got the power. We ain't got the media to run for president. But we can be ingenious about it and bait them and trick them. We definitely uh, achieved getting assaulted during our presidential campaign years. Uh, that happened several times. And seeing how fake the world is, I pretty much any time anything happens, I'm like, oh, what the hell are you guys up to this time? Pretty much every single interaction. If a squirrel walks by, I'm like, what the fuck are you going to do with the squirrel this time, man? I mean, because seriously... I, you can, can the humans are just mindless bots sometimes some of them are just like mindless clones and then i'm supposed to think of squirrels are like an ultimate all-knowing god instead i think i think the squirrels on the cheaper they've made robotic dogs already for your children to play with right they haven't made other things that look like humans and told you they exist upon the planet Got to make sure I word that correctly, because we don't know how many humans are actually here on this um, virtual reality headset, whatever it is that makes the Earth look and appear, and people say it's a ball spinning in space. Whatever it is, it does that, along with other manipulations, you know. And it marks itself, too. So you got to question it. But does that happen to everyone? Like, come on. you telling me all these politicians have had people assaulting them? Come on, man. Lindsey Graham did not, get a, did not have people stalking him and assaulting him when he was running. He still doesn't. You'd think he would if I do. If I go out there and that happens to me before, I can even trick bait the media into covering me. You'd think someone go beat up Lindsey Graham. Watch. I wonder if just because I simply say those words that he's about to get jacked, dude. I mean, and just because it happens doesn't mean I'm the one who did it because I don't feel alone in this world. I mean, I do completely, but it almost feels like it's just two people here. Like a chess game or something. Isn't that odd, too? Like a as I walk through the place and I see everything and I learn it and I live through it. That's the crazy part is I live through these stories. But um, I do feel like they make pictures of two people playing chess. And it feels that way sometimes. I'm not even sure, you know, like what to trust. Because how the, the stories, the, the people talking about the God stuff... Do I trust them? There's what? How many of them? 20, 30? Einstein's God, Jesus is God, Satan is God, Allah is God. Um, why would I trust any of them? Especially if it's like the similar people. What are they just hosts in a game or something? How do they magically appear like that? Shapeshifters? Like teleporting? Am I inventing people with my mind? Is that's what's going on in the world? Because it's like, that actually is pretty logical. Because of the stuff I've seen, like, I can claim 40% of the stuff in the world I see just came from my mind. Easily. Easily. I, uh, some things don't line up like that, though. So, it's like, okay, so what am I up against here? But, um... Why do the humans allow the gang stalking to happen? Shouldn't this come into light? All these people who can come talk to a politician and tell them about his personal life or a stranger as if they're there to threaten them and let them know, like, hey, hey, we know a lot about you. We're just stalking you here. 
Why is that a, a loud? That's a crime syndicate.